1986, I was invited to paint a tram for the Victorian Government Art Program. Huge tins of Dulux house paint and um, go for it, Leslie. <laughs> So I drew it all up with a ruler and you know, then started filling it in and it took about three weeks. But it was a lot of fun doing it. My tram has been brought back to life for the festival this year, which is very exciting for it. It was a collaborative process with Kate and it was quite fascinating because the height and the scale and everything about the trams has changed. So a number of things had to be thought about. We had to get from the original tram photographs and images from today's tram in a bad condition. The challenge was how to recreate that and be, still be true to the original. So the decision was made to redraw it in Illustrator rather than trying to clean up the photographs. And I'm very much looking forward to seeing how that came out. Oh, it's much bigger than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> because the original tram would have been half this size. This is much bolder. I'm, I'm thrilled with it actually. <laughs> it's terrific. I'm enormously proud that it's happened. I actually think it's better than the first tram. And what I loved about it was I didn't have to paint it again. <laughs> I feel very much part of Melbourne and I'm delighted that I've had this chance again. It's lovely.